everybody. I wanted to show you real quick a little tip on making samples out of your chunk bars um, or even just making your chunk bars slightly smaller so that they are a little bit more manageable because these are pretty big. This is the B Sweet Stand Tall Wear Crown and it smells like a pina colada. It's really fruity, fresh. You can smell the coconut and the pineapple. It's really nice. Um, and so the way I do this <clears throat> is I heat up the bar. Um, I do 10 seconds and then I flip it. And I do 10 seconds and I flip it. Um, every microwave is a little bit different. I always say do 10 second increments. When I take it out, the sides are slightly soft. There's no discoloration to it. Um, if you do it for too long, you can get this little like white bubble in the middle and you don't want that. Um, the bar shouldn't be too hot to hold, um, but it should definitely be very warm. Um, and then what I do is I use a sharp serrated knife. And it cuts just like butter. And so I cut them about this thick. Um, and this right here is what I would do for a personal bar. Um, I'd stick this in the shower and I get about 10 of these out of one bar. Um, if I'm looking to make samples, I cut it slightly thinner. As you can see the difference, cut it slightly thinner. And then I just take this little piece right here and I cut it in half. So this is about the size of the samples that I would do. Um, when you're making chunk bar samples, essentially you want your customers to be able to get two to three uses out of a bar. Um, you don't need to give them a huge chunk that's going to last them a month. Um, you just want them to be able to try it a few times enough to see how it smells and feels and decide whether or not they like it. So let me go ahead and show you about how many samples I get when I do it this way. And I'm making these a little bit bigger than I usually do because it is a new product and a lot of these are going to my hostesses and my VIPs. So they get a little bit better samples. Um, if you really wanted to, you could even take these and cut them one more time. And even that is a sufficient size to wash your hands a couple times and get a feel for it. Um, or one shower to use you know, on a loofah. If you're finding that when you're cutting your chunk bars, they start to flake, um, or you're getting real kind of like jagged edges and it's not cutting real smooth, pop it back in the microwave for another 10 seconds. Um, you definitely want it to be warm enough that it's going to cut easily. You don't want to have to struggle with it. Um, and then you get samples that are not quite as pretty. So I just wanted to show you guys a close-up of one of these real quick. I don't know if you can see that little yellow spot. There are chunks of pineapple in here. I mean, you can see the little black seeds. You can see the pieces of pineapple. Mm, these bars are awesome. They're made with fresh ingredients. They smell amazing. So I am done cutting up my samples. Like I said, I'm going to leave one big bar for myself. Um, but this is about the size with and I get about 20 samples out of one bar doing it this way. And that includes saving a good size chunk for myself. Um, again, this is the Be Sweet Stand Tall Wear a Crown Pineapple Coconut Chunk Bar. And if you want any more information on this one or some of the other chunk bars we have, be sure to check out the links below in the comments. And don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Have a good day.